Okay, folks, for this lesson, what we are going to be doing is we're going to be um, basically mining work we've already completed. So if you've been working like you're supposed to, this will not be a difficult lesson for you. Um, if, if you haven't been working, well, this is a good chance to catch up. Okay, in your, um, in your Shapes and Shadows um, work, you have a Max Dupain and an Olive Cotton Frame Analysis. Okay, so basically what's going to happen is you're going to get your... Um, your slideshow template, which you should already have started working on, and you are going to um, give me slides 16 and slide 17 of this particular slideshow. Now, 16 is where you're going to have Max Dupain frame analysis, and 17 is where you're going to have the information on Olive Cotton, as per the template. The template, if you don't know where to find it, is now um, assignment slideshow template at the bottom here. So all the information you need is on these, this line, this line and this line. Okay, so it won't be hard. Um, the frame analysis for Max Dupain, we did, um, we worked on um, the frame analysis of this painting here um, at Newport. So I want you to insert the, um, obviously under the title of Max Dupain frame analysis, I want you to insert the, um, the image, give it a title, and then I want you to give me subjective frame um, and basically cut and paste questions and answers for each of the frames that I got you to do. Um, once you've done that, um, I also want you to write a short biography telling me um, you know, who Max Dupain was, um, when he was born, um, and what his work was about, basically. So just give me a short biography of you know, um, a, a paragraph or two. Now, if you can't fit it all on one slide, by all means, add slides to the presentation. I don't want you cramming things in. And once you've done that, step back um, do the same for olive cotton take her frame analysis that you did on um, teacup ballet um, cut and paste the image in cut and paste the um, information about the image underneath it and then do um, cut and paste the questions from um, each of the frames so we did subjective and we did structural frame. So that was just two frames for that one. So that all that information you should already have. That Those um, questions and answers and these images get cut and pasted along with, once again, a short biography for Olive Cotton this time. So that's today's lesson. Um, I will write this information under this uh, short video as well. Um, uh, have fun with it. I'll uh, see you in the next lesson.